Okay, what's going on guys? So today I'm making a quick video on how to get um, better internet connection on PlayStation uh, just through Wi-Fi, so no LAN. Um, I do have, I do use LAN cables as well. I, I actually tried to CAT6 and CAT5e. If you don't know what the CAT uh, cables are, they're basically both ethernet cables, so LAN cables, and they just um, have different speeds depending on which... Um, which cable is compatible with your system in in terms of ps4 i believe both can be used but um this is just this tutorial just going to cover uh wi-fi so this has nothing to do with ethernet connection so um let's get started so basically the first thing i'm going to do is uh go to network go to settings and then go to network and i'm going to set up a connection to wi-fi and then we're going to go easy. So basically, under the same Wi-Fi, I have two networks. One is Shadow Hunters, which is the top one. And the second one is Dark Knight 5G. So Shadow Hunters is in the 2.4G network. And Dark Knight is on the 5G network. So first, so this is my main Wi-Fi. Basically, all my devices are connected to Shadow Hunters. So we're going to first go and check with Shadow Hunters, which is on a 2.4G network and basically see what the speeds are. Okay, so it says that the download speed is 45.6 and the upload is 7.2. So that's not very good because I actually pay for internet 300, so it's 300 megabytes per second. Now I do know that PS4 doesn't is not gonna be able to keep up all the way till 300. That's just how the system is. Um, PS4 is slower than Xbox in terms of testing internet connections, but um, when I switch to the 5G network through just Wi-Fi and just the easy settings. Um, let's just let this happen and then we'll just compare the results. Okay, so under 5G, I'm actually getting 148.3 megabytes per second for my download and 8.1 megabytes per second for my upload, which is obviously faster than what I was getting on the other network. So um, basically, 5G is a much less populated network than 2.4. Most people who have Wi-Fi use 2.4. Most people that game on Wi-Fi, which, you know, obviously you have to if you want to play online, is on the 2.4 network. So basically, this just proves that playing on 5G network, you do get much better connection. And um, basically, I was playing on 2.4 for a while and I kept lagging after a few games on Rainbow Six Siege. And, you know, I thought it was because I'm not using a LAN connection and Ethernet cable. So when I got Ethernet connection and it did improve the gameplay, I wasn't lagging as much. But ultimately, the 5G network is what worked for me. So just through Wi-Fi, that is a solution. I believe that every internet provider has a 2.4 network and a 5G network. So if you're not familiar whether you have a 5G network hooked up with your internet service provider, no matter who it is, um, you can call them, you can ask them, or you, know, you can go online, you can uh, research about that. For me, I was lucky because um, I had someone who helped me with that and he, he told me that 5G is much better for gaming because it's much less populated. But if you didn't know that, there you go. That's going to be extremely helpful because I absolutely never lag on the 5G network. And for me personally, it is faster than the LAN cable as well. Like I said earlier, like I use LAN cables, Ethernet cables, and there's just nothing that has been as fast as 5G, even though it's Wi-Fi. So that's pretty impressive.